Welcome to the read aloud titled, It Looked Like Spilt Milk by Charles G. Shaw. So that's on the front cover. When I flip over to the back cover, I'm going to read you something and then I'm going to give you a little job. So, it looked like spilt milk. Sometimes it looked like spilt milk, but it wasn't spilt milk. Sometimes it looked like a bird or an ice cream cone or a birthday cake or an angel, but it wasn't a bird or an ice cream cone or a birthday cake or an angel. What was it? So, just like that question, what was it? I am going to read this story and it's going to tell us, just like it did on the back cover, what looked like spilt milk, what looked like an ice cream cone, and what looked like all these different things. As I'm reading, your job is to think, what could it be? Just like the back cover asked, what was it? So keep those thoughts in your head. Maybe you've heard the story and you know, maybe you haven't. So let's find out. It looked like spilt milk by Charles G. Shaw. Sometimes it looked like spilt milk, but it wasn't spilt milk. Sometimes it looked like a rabbit, but it wasn't a rabbit. Sometimes it looked like a bird, but it wasn't a bird. You're starting to think, what could that be? Sometimes it looked like a tree, but it wasn't a tree. Sometimes it looked like an ice cream cone, but it wasn't an ice cream cone. Sometimes it looked like a flower, but it wasn't a flower. Do you have a guess, if you haven't heard this story before, what you think it could be? Looking like all those different things? Maybe you're right, let's find out. Sometimes it looked like a pig but it wasn't a pig. Sometimes it looked like a birthday cake, but it wasn't a birthday cake. Sometimes it looked like a sheep, but it wasn't a sheep. Sometimes it looked like a great horned owl, but it wasn't a great horned owl. Sometimes it looked like a mitten, but it wasn't a mitten. Wow, whatever this is, is looking very different, like many different things. You have a guess? All right, we'll see. It gives it at the end, so we'll find out. Sometimes it looked like a squirrel, but it wasn't a squirrel. Sometimes it looked like an angel, but it wasn't an angel. Sometimes it looked like spilt milk, but it wasn't spilt milk. It was just a cloud in the sky. Thumbs up if you knew that. Thumbs down if you didn't. At first, I didn't know what it was, but after I have read it more than once, I knew it was a cloud. So, if you didn't get it, that's okay. Now you know. Sometimes it looks like spilt milk and all these different things. So, I hope you enjoyed this story. And as an extension to the story, if you can at home, you can do two things that make this book even more fun. First, you can look up at the sky and do just like this. That looks like an ice cream cone, that looks like a squirrel, that looks like cake, a bird, all those fun things. Another thing that you can do, which is one of my favorites, you can take a piece of paper, any type of paper you want, any color. I just chose blue kind of like the sky. Then you can take paint. If you have white, that's great. If not, that's okay. And you take your full piece of paper, like here, and you drip all in the middle. I'll show you what I did on the other side in a minute. Boop, 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 anywhere on the paper. Then you take this whole piece of paper, fold it evenly in half to make a half, press, 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 and then open up and see what does it look like? Wow, I have two inter interesting spots. 
This to me almost looks like a fox or a type of mouse or an animal like that that might be eating something. Up here, that almost looks like maybe an upside down fox. Maybe it's a little baby being silly on a mummy's back. I don't know. What do you think? What does this look like? Maybe. Yeah. Hey, it's what you think it looks like. There's no right or wrong answers. So, now that you know that story, it looked like spilt milk, hopefully you can do one of those two activities I just gave you. Either just get outside, look at the clouds, and say what they look like. You could also just write in your journal, make pictures of clouds in your journal or on a piece of paper. Or last, actually that's three things, last you can also do this fun activity with paper, paint, and fold it in half and see what yours look like. Maybe it does look like spilt milk.